missed the fireball coming back the other way. And they're going slow this time. But that was terrifying. You hear how loud those motors are? God. The firemen, they're so cool. I, I love firemen and all, man. Really. But that that was terrifying. Uh, you know, I'm I'm I got PTSD. I'm I'm a wreck, and uh, <clears throat> so you know I've been so tortured and abused by authority and everybody else. And I'm just like I'm a mess, and I, I'm worried about this other boat because it was banging against the rocks, and. I don't even want to look right now, because there's nothing I can do. If it sinks, it sinks, and that's that, you know? Uh, there's nothing I can do. Look at it. And that's from a slow pass. Let me see if I can... Wow. The firemen have the biggest boats in the world. They are so powerful. I mean, they're not naval ships or whatever, but for the size, you know, it's like five times the size of this boat and they can go literally 100 miles an hour. The water that gets put out of the back of that boat is like six foot waves at that speed. And I stay out of the ocean when the ocean is two feet, three feet or more. I'm like, no, I cannot handle that. It's just too much. I'm not experienced enough. And, and you know, I don't know what my boat can do, what it can't do. It's pitch black out here, but my goodness. Okay, things are a little calm. Now, when they just went by at that speed with those rumbling <laughs> motors, even just that, you could see the boats are bouncing and, you know, but they came by so fast. Zoom! And the thing was smashing against the rocks. Now, I, I got... Wow, it looks like it came off. Oh, now I gotta go over there. Get off this boat and go over there and check on that boat because it looks like the thing that I used to keep it from smashing against the rocks has finally been smashed off. Uh, so, now I'm gonna have to go. It is so cold out here. It's like 30 something degrees. I don't even know what this thing says. Uh, what does it say? 35 is what it says. And it's not measuring the actual outside outside. It's measuring the outside in one of the holes where the gasoline is because I keep that one open all the time so the gas fumes don't blow into the boat, they blow outside. And uh, so it, it, this Arctic cold has come down. It is 35 inside right now and 39 uh, outside and 39 inside because I got the, you know, I had the heater on for a little while. I had to go buy another can of propane. I broke my jigsaw, which was already broken. I can't get the blades in anymore. They won't hold. I don't have the right stuff to jam it in there. My drill is a battery drill and it ran out of power. So, um, I don't know. Hi. Wow. Let's see if we can see where I'm at so far. Uh, okay. I got this pressure tank here um, for a water system. It's made out of metal. And so since I didn't have a jigsaw, I drilled a bunch of holes across the top. First I pounded it down. And then I've been sitting out here with the, with the uh, tin snips, you know, trying to cut a square in this thing. If I had the right tools, I would be 